I wasn't really even sure whether to bother putting this video on, um, but it does show how difficult it is to get in the water here. The, the slipways are just too shallow to trailer launch, so I have to launch off the beach. That means waiting for the tides um, and weather, and it's just not easy to get in and out you know, quickly. I can't suddenly think, oh, the weather's gone not so good, let's pull the boat out. I have to wait. So um, anyway, so I, I put the video up anyway, just just, just because. Um, but that's why I'm thinking of these new designs. The, the, the idea is to try and keep keep them low down, lighter and low, so that I could launch off a trailer. This one is the um, 900 mil pressure hull, which is, which is coming on with the design. And this one, I think I've shown this before, is the 650 mil pressure hull. Um, and if I show you this, actually, the I put my little man in there. Um, you can see uh, that that's actually it's really really shallow. So this would be this would be easy. Well, I could actually launch this off a trailer. Right, let's see if there's any wind. There is a bit of wind, Ruby. Right, well, there's a little bit of wind. Force three to four, it gives it. I'm gonna go around and get the boat. That's my brother arriving. He's got this thing all rigged up, Gil. Uh, yeah, it's, it's ready to go. Right, we're just having a chat about uh, what we're going to do. And uh, I'm all ready, everything's here. I just bought the boat round. But I think we've just sort of decided that it's going to be too windy. Uh, although it doesn't look too bad now. It was really quite rough out there when I brought the boat round. And the wind is northwest. And when the tide comes up here, it's going to be quite rough in here so although I hate to say it I think we're gonna to have to postpone and this will be the last attempt for this year so I'm gonna go and put everything away and go to work um, it's really quite disappointing but uh, I think we have to be safe you know, I'd rather sit here at lunchtime thinking oh, I would have been alright rather than going out there at lunchtime thinking oh, I'm gonna be sure I'm here so I'm going to have a safe option. Well, it's lunchtime and I'm actually quite relieved to see that it is actually still quite windy. There's some wind surface out there and that's where I wanted to get to out and it's uh, definitely pretty pretty rough out there even though it won't look it in this area. just get a, some sort of lower down dolly or something and push it in with poles but you know I thought about something like this but even then when 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 the sub is on here the the depth of water needed to get it into the into the water is just it's just too much I, I went out on the boat today to go and have a look and to get to two meters of water I mean you're probably about I don't know 30 to 40 meters away from the from the shoreline and um, it just it's just impossible.
So I quickly knocked, knocked off a um, slipway, and, and I think they're about eight degrees here, which is just not much at all. So you can see it, it just isn't enough. Um, I've just got to think of some other way of getting in the water into two meters of water easier somehow. Got to think of something. But anyway, the next day the weather was really good, but the tide wasn't right. I guess it was a neap tide, so there's not enough tidal movement. Uh, so I went fishing instead. <laughs>